Greetings programs! Neo Mega Man back again. It's time for episode 99 of Neo's Mugen Saturday Showdown. Yeah, buddy. We are on to the penultimate episode before our episode 100 extravaganza. And today promises to be just literally chock full of dynamite. I mean, look who we've got curtain jerking. In the left corner, it's Shadow Man from Mega Man 3. And he'll be taking on Kiva, arguably one of the most dangerous men on my singles roster. Oh boy. No beating around the bush for this one, folks. Let's just get straight down to a random stage and start the fireworks early. I hope you're all as excited as I am. Shadow Man ready. Kiva ready. Let's go. Alright, immediately Shadow Man gets things started with a low kick to a uh, body slam. Oh, Kiva with a big backflip kick there. Kiva dodging Shadow Man's di uh, dive kicks there. Oh, another big backflip kick to Shadow Man's face. Whoop, Shadow Man manages to land at least some of the uh, Shadow Blade spam there. Low Shadow Blade missed as Kiva gets another backflip kick. Oh, another backflip kick. Kiva favoring that move. I wonder how many times he's going to go to the well before it fails him. The oh, man. Kiva lands a big tornado special right to the blue shot. Couple of kicks lands. Uh, Shadow Man lands. Another big backflip kick. Shadow Man tried the uh, flipping kicks there. Oh, manages to block part of Kiva's combo. Another big backflip kick there. Kiva firmly in control of this match. Uh-oh, Shadow Clone Jutsu nails Kiva for some good damage. Kiva, oh, lands the big tornado again. Right to the big blue uh, heavy shot there. Shadow Man not really having a good answer for Kiva's uh, speed here. Oh man, big stomp throw right to the face punches. Gives Kiva the win in round number one. Alright, let's see if Shadow Man can do something here in round number two. Oof, not like that. He's not gonna. A couple of low sweep kicks land from Kiva. Oh, big body slam right to a head kick there. Shadow Man goes invisible, but I don't think that's gonna help him. Kiva's got that Kamen Rider vision. Lands the big blue tornado right to a couple of big stomp kicks there. Kiva combling freely in the corner. Shadow Man getting his face kicked in. Another big blue tornado right to the big blue shot there. As Kiva comes right back into the aerial combo, right to the face smashes. Shadow Man not doing too happy. Yeah, that was not going well for Shadow Man at all. Dong. Yep. Well, there you have it, folks. First match of the evening, first 2-0 of the night. Kiba in high style, taking down Shadow Man. And surprisingly enough, both these guys are going to doubles next season. Yeah. I'm not going to say with who, because that'd be spoilers. But, yep, Shadow Man and Kiva both are going to doubles division next, well, next year, technically. So, yeah, that'll be interesting to see. Okay, enough tarrying from me. Let's get on to our second big singles match of the evening. And we are back with our second big singles match of the evening, and this one promises to be a hell of a fight, folks. In the left corner, we've got Benny Maru Nikaido. Gonna be going up against Possessed Hata. Yeah. Uh, this one's gonna be a mess, folks. I'm not even gonna lie. Benny Maru, he's got some pretty fast lightning kicks there, plus the, uh, that big Benny Maru collider throw that she's, uh, so known for. But Hata, Hata's got the combos to make the, uh, the fight interesting, at least. So, uh, yeah, who knows what's going to happen on this one, honestly. Okay, enough talk out of me. Let's get down to a random stage. Watch these two kick butt.
Benny Moore ready? Wait already in Captain Falcon mode. Let's go. Oh, big backflip kick there as they trade the trade kicks there. Oh, Benny Moore with the big spinning sweep kick there. Oh, big Falcon kick there knocks Benny Moore off his feet. Oh, good good punch there. Oh, Benny Moore collider. There you go. Oh, wow, Benny Moore gets countered into a big uh, rising dragon punch there. Good Falcon kick there. Oh, misses a good punch. Benny Moore. Oh, misses the chirping birds. That could be costly. Oh, hate to misses a punch, but gets another rising dragon through. This is another good punch. Again, they're trading blows a little bit here. Oh, Benny Moore collider keeping the uh, life totals pretty even. Oh, and again, they're just trading blows on these kicks. Oh, but Benny Moore collider putting him ahead in the life totals again. Benny Moore playing mind games, trying to stay away from Heita. Oof. Good, uh, good right token. Oh, 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 oh. Man, that special almost did Heita in. All it's going to take is, yep, one more cherry tap, and that was all she wrote for Heita. Understand? Woo! Benny Moore are looking tough there. All right, let's see about round number two. Again, they just trade kicks right there. Oh, again, Heita misses a big special there, but oh, gets a combo right to a rising dragon. Oh, Benny Moore hits him with a lightning backflip kick. Oh, 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 Heita comboing freely. Oh, another big rising dragon. Benny Moore taking a buttload of damage on that one. Oof, another hate to kick right to a rising dragon. Oh, Hata misses a big punch. Oh, but hits a rising dragon again. Oh, Benny Moore lands a knee, but Hata. Oh, Hata blocks the chirping birds. Probably a good thing. Oh, spinning sweet kick. Benny Moore gets hit with a Hata kick. Hata really trying to bring this back here. Oh, misses a uh, big punch there. Oh, but hits it that time right to a kick combo, and Benny Moore goes down hard. Well, possess Hata looked pretty good in that round. Let's see who takes round number three. Oof! Benny Moore getting hit pretty early with Hata's big combos there. Oh, man. Benny Moore just taking it on that one. Took it on the chin hard. Oh, big rising dragon there from Hata. Benny Moore rolls. Oh, super collider. Not good for Hata. But unfortunately, Benny Moore right back into the combos. Oh, collider saves him a little more damage. Oh, he misses, misses one collider, hits a second one, though. Oh, big punch right to him. Uh, Hate to kick. Oh, Benny Moore counters with a big kick to the face. Makes, oh, gets uh, hit with a kick as he backflip kicks Hata. Another Benny Moore collider getting the uh, life totals back to even there. Oh, man, Benny Moore was going for a big backflip kick, but Hata interrupted him. Oh, 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 Hata comboing freely. Big Hata kick. Oh, this is the Rising Dragon there. Gets a diving kick through. Oh, Benny Moore with the drill kick. Haven't seen him use that one in a while. Oh, big fireball from Hata. And Hata with the big time win. Woo, I'm becoming a real man. Yeah, boy. Hata with a big time victory. 2-1 over Benny Maru Nikaido. Damn, son. I mean... Not all that unexpected. Hayda's been doing pretty well this season. But for him to come up 2-1 over Benny Maru, that's, that's impressive. Well, we got our first three-rounder of the evening. That's good news. Uh, so, yeah. That was fun. All right. Let's get on to our doubles matches for the evening. Trust me, this promises to be just as interesting. So, yeah. All right. Double's going to kick butt, so let's get right down to it. And we are on to our first doubles match of the evening, folks, and this one is going to be nuts. In the left corner, we've got Dragon Claw and Skilla Chimere. Going to be taking on X and Zero. Yeah, the Maverick Hunters back for their final match of the season. Oh, boy. I got nothing on this one, folks. I mean, seriously. Either one of these teams could pull it off. Dragon Claw and Skilla got the big-time specials to keep up with X and Zero. X and Zero's size might play a little bit of a uh, part in this match, but I kind of doubt it. So... Yeah, let's just get down to a random stage and watch these four rip it up. Beginning the mission. 
It's time to find out who between Dragon Claw and Skill and X and Zero will win. Alright, Dragon Claw immediately getting things started. Big time aerial combo after the big melee combo. Good Lord, X and Zero getting juggled by hell. Oh, looks like X got hit with Skill as big special. That's gonna do some serious damage. Oh, mother! Yeah, that tore X in half. Good gravy. Dragon Ball comboing freely, taking X to school here. Looks like X and Zero might not have a good answer for Dragon Ball. Oh, oh, well, X got a good combo off there. Oh, Dragon Ball kind of get caught between their attacks again. Big throw there on Skilla. Oof, X and Zero both got caught. Oh, man, with a big special there. Oh. Oh, nuts. Another big combo, or big special there from Dragon Claw. Right into the big Twirling Tornado special. X and Zero on a severe health deficit now. Big Storm Tornado right to a big shot there. X, Zero misses the big uh, Raging Demon throw. X kind of get comboed to hell from behind there. Oh, looks like Zero is going to be taken out by Skilla's big special. Mother of God, that hurts. Whoa! Yeah, that's all she wrote for Zero, folks. But X, X still fighting his heart out. A big throw there on uh, Dragon Claw. Skilla just kind of, ooh, sitting there for a minute as Dragon Claw gets a low dash to finish X off. Dragon Claw and Skilla victorious in round one. Let's see about round number two. Dragon Claw again just comboing freely. Zero kind of getting hit by it. Skilla with a, uh, a big special combo up in the air there. Dragon Claw comboing. Looks like he's got a, a bit going on there as Skilla gets a throw off on X. Big beam special. Oh, wow. Big uh, Tenma Gozonku there from uh, Zero. Man, X and Zero again getting comboed to hell in the air by both Dragon Claw and Skilla. Big aerial combo. As, uh, oh, another big throw there from X on... Oh, wow. Big special combo there on Dragon Claw from uh, X there. Zero kind of getting taken to school here. Dragon Claw getting comboed in the corner a little bit. Oh man, looks like X is going to get hit with uh, with Skilla's big combo here. I don't know if that's going to be enough to take him out, but we'll see. Yep, that's all she wrote for Zero. Oh wait, X, I mean. Zero, no wait, Zero goes down. X is still standing. Unfortunately, he's getting comboed to hell. And that's all she wrote for X in the corner. Wow. Dragon Claw and Skilla, absolute domination from start to finish on X and Zero. Giving them a, uh, a one-way ticket to Pain Town. 2 nothing. Well, that was special. Okay. Well, unfortunately, that's all for doubles number one. Didn't quite deliver like I thought it would, but hey, you know, it happens. So, let's get on to doubles number two and see what awaits us there. And we are back with our second big double set of the evening and basically the main event for tonight. Oh boy. This is, uh, this is big news, folks. Kim and E.G., are going to be taking on Big Evil, Narlothotep, and Dark Nation. Uh, this could get bad, folks, for one team or the other. I don't know which. If Narlothotep and Dark Nation really get on it, Kim and Eiji could be screwed. But if Kim and Eiji play their game like they always do and put the pedal to the metal fast and don't let up, Dark Nation and Narlothotep might not have a good answer for them. Now, after this, there will be another tournament match. In fact, it'll be the other semifinals match, and it will be good. But, uh, yeah, this, this is an important match, folks. Big Evil have done really well this season, but so have Kim and Eiji. Kim and Eiji have been kicking ass ever since they re-premiered on my show. So, yeah. Let's get down to a random stage. Oh boy, hope I'm ready. Elafotep and Dark Nation ready. Kim and Eiji ready. 
Here we go. Alright, immediately Dark Nation starts with the elbow throw. Oh, big special there on Kim as he gets, uh... As he gets uh, carved by the Arlothotep. The Arlothotep will be countered now. Big combo there as uh, Kim gets a big backflip kick. Big throw there right to a couple of stomps on, uh, on Kim there. Oh man, the Arlothotep can't save her partner from a uh, oh, big combo there. Oh wow, big special there from the Arlothotep cutting the other team in half. Dark Nation kind of getting comboed by uh, EG here. Uh oh. EG got caught with a big time three bar. Raging Demon special. Could this be all for EG? No, EG's still standing. Kim gonna catch Dark Nations to his demise there. Now it's down to Yarlathotep versus both boys. Little shield break counter there. Kim and EG trying hard. Oh, EG lands the big ninja slash special. That does a buttload of damage, Yarlathotep. Oh, tried to counter, tried to counter out of her, uh, out of her down state, but no, EG with the big laser slash takes her Lothothep down. Holy cow, that was close. Uh, Kim. Kim, it's okay. You, you can stop dashing now. You guys won. Okay, uh, that's better. Wow, Kim and EG barely hung on for the win in that round. Let's see if Dark Nation and Yarlathotep can do something better in round number two here. Oh, big Maelstrom there, right to a big combo from... Uh, oh, another big Maelstrom. Big elbow dash combo, another Maelstrom from Dark Nation. Yarlathotep was trying to charge the special meter there. Oh, big oh, aerial throw there from, uh, from EG. Oh, Dark Nation getting cut in half by that... Uh, Oh wow, big combo from your Yarlathotep as EG combos Dark Nation in the corner. Another big super special from Kim there. Yarlathotep gives a big throw on Kim there as Dark Nation gets a big uh, combo there. Looks like uh, EG might have gotten a special block there. Yarlathotep gets hit with a big time combo. Dark Nation, unfortunately... Oh wow! Dark Nation takes out Kim! Now it's down to EG versus both... Uh, Oh, and Yarlathotep gets hit with the big time ninja special. There goes Dark Nation. Yarlathotep barely has any health left. No, she gets denied. Holy crap, it came down to EG with barely enough health to survive as Yarlathotep dropped the combo and EG made her pay. Wow. Man, what a two rounder. That was about as close as you can get for a two rounder, folks. It almost came down to the last hit, and Yarlathotep almost had enough gumption to take out EG even after he had hit her with the uh, the ninja dash or the ninja slash special. Good gravy! Well, only the one round three so far, so yeah, that's just how it goes sometimes, folks. But damn, good performance out of both Kim and EG and Dark Nation and Yarlathotep. I mean, that was a hell of a fight, folks. Unfortunately, Big Evil's streak ends here. Kim and EG looking pretty good going into next season now. Wonder what, uh, wonder what hurdles they'll overcome next. Alright, folks. You know what this means. Stay tuned for our final... Not final, but our semi-final tournament match is going to be a hot one. So, I'll be right back with that. And welcome back to the main event for Neo's Mugen Saturday Showdown Episode 99. Oh man, this is another match that I have been dreading, folks. I don't want to see either one of these teams lose, but somebody's got to. On the left, we've got Hellboy, The Crow, Blade, and John Constantine. The red-hot Team Supernatural, who have been nothing but fire since they premiered. And in the right corner, we've got Psycho Yoko, Psychopath Kyo, Shen Wu, and Iori. The Lunatics who have also been nothing but fire in this tournament. 
one of these two teams is taking a fall today, folks. But uh, whoever it is, the other team is going to be going down swinging. So, for old time's sake, we're going to the Metro City Arena. Because it'll be the last time it probably appears this season. So, without any further ado, let's light this candle. <laughs> Team Supernatural ready. Team Lunatics ready. Here we go. All right, the Lunatics are immediately on the attack. Oh, man, big head bomb special there from uh, Psychopath Theo. Yoko hits some good combos from behind. Man, Team Supernatural just getting wrecked. Big aura burst from Shen Wu doing a crap ton of damage. Whoa, holy shit. That was some big hits from Iori there. Team Supernatural already in danger. Wow, I can't even see with all the bodies flying around. Another big aura burst from Shen Wu. Looks like Blade and Constantine might already be down. And there goes the Crow and Hellboy in the corner. Holy crap, dude. The Lunatics were unbelievable. Alright, let's see if Team Supernatural can do something here in round number two. Maybe. Another big aura burst from Shen Wu doing a crap ton of damage to uh, Constantine. Uh, Blade, you were a little high there on the uh, gun special. Big machine gun there taking some damage off of Shen Wu. Big uppercut there. Uh oh, here come the big gun specials from uh, the Crow. If he could get those going again. Oh man, John Constantine with a gun special of his own. Team Supernatural trying to fight back here. Hellboy blocking a big combo from Shen Wu in the air. Here comes Psycho Kyo and Iori. And Kia and uh, Yoko doing some good damage in the corner. Oh man, big machine gun special by Blade from behind here. Another big melee combo string from. Uh, oh man, here comes the gun special from the Crow. Here comes the Crow special from the Crow. Oh, big shotgun right there from uh, right there from the Crow. Looks like uh, Psycho Yoko might be the only one left standing on her team. Oh man, boy that hurt. Oh man, one up special. Getting thrown up on. Uh... My turn. Oh man, Hellboy misses a couple of big specials there. Big machine gun special. Team Supernatural fighting for their lives here, and Psycho Yoko goes down hard. Team Supernatural fighting back and taking round two, and we are going to a round three, baby. Here we go. Oh man, hard to see what's going on as Blade jumped up already. Man, big time uh, flame strike there. Oh, here comes the gun special from the crow. More guns from the crow. Big uh, aura burst sp uh, ground special there from Iori. Hellboy jumping in. Big time melee combo, but it gets broken up by uh, Iori. Shen Wu. Oh, man. Shen Wu and Psycho Kyo doing some. Oh, man. Here come the big anime girl rush special. Big super falcon kick there from Shen Wu. Here come the gun specials again from uh, from the crow. Here comes a big shotgun. Oh, that hurts. The rest of the team up on their feet. Here comes Blade with the gun specials too. Here comes the crow. The crow making it happen. Could it be, folks? Here goes John Constantine with a gun special of his own. Psycho Yoko still standing, but no, John Constantine with the big double hand uppercut takes her down, and Supernatural pulls off the unlikely upset, and the Lunatics go down 2-1 to Team Supernatural. Whoo! Holy hot damn in a can, folks. That was rough. That one took quite a bit out of me. But unbelievable as it may be, the Lunatics take a fall and Team Supernatural go on to the finals to face the Robot Masters in episode 100. Man, what a fight. What a show. Two big three-rounders, really close two-rounders. I mean, Jesus, dude. That was fun right there is what that was. Oh boy. 
I, uh, I got nothing left. I'm tired. I'm knackered. <laughs> okay. Well, that's all for the penultimate episode of Neo's Moogan Saturday Showdowns, episode 99, season 2, whatever. Do what you guys do down in the comment section below. You know I love it. As for me, I am your host, Neo Mega Man, signing off. End of line.